I'm just saying, she might be awesome. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure Phil, the bass player's friend from rehab's sister, is awesome. <laughs> but I'm sorry, I just don't see the allure of going out with somebody I don't know. Well, that's the allure. She doesn't know you. <laughs> hey, it's not me, okay? I happen to be an excellent dater. <laughs> it's the women I've gone out with lately, okay? <laughs> I'm telling you, one whack job after another. I'm, I'm, I love babies. They're, they're so innocent. They have no idea they'll be dead one day. No idea. I have a photographic memory. So change something on the table, and I'll know exactly what it is. Even the slightest bit, right? That napkin wasn't there, and you're gone. Which do you like? My friend is trying to fix me up on sort of this blind date, but I don't know, it's definitely, hmm, and I know, blah, blah, take a chance and all, but yeesh. Hey, wow, what are you gonna do, right? I met my wife during a pogrom when Cossacks torched our village. Yeah, well, it's a lot harder now. Seriously, Ivor, you have no idea how many strange guys there are out there. So I go, mono, mono, and you go, doo, 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 doo. and I go, mono, mono. What's wrong? Do you, oh, do you want to do the mono, Because I'll do the doo, 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 doo. <laughs> and then I'm like, wait, you can't touch me there. You're my uncle. <laughs> She better be awesome. I just hope he's not weird. <laughs> Hi. Are you waiting for me? Yeah. Hi. Hi. Uh, so you ready to go? Yeah. Could you just hold my purse? Oh, <laughs> uh, wait. I thought you needed to do something. No. I just don't like holding my purse. <laughs> well, it's not that interesting of a story. I, I, I studied physics at Yale, but then uh, Harvard and MIT offered me a competing fellowship from just for mathematics. Wow. So what do you do? I work in a used record store. No. No, no, it's, it's, it's a good thing. Ah, how do I explain? Uh, have you heard of Maxwell Solomon? The author? Didn't he go crazy at some book launch and start signing books in his own... Urine. Yeah, that's my dad. <laughs> Wait, I've heard of your family. Aren't they like these geniuses who do great things and then go... In insane. Yeah, but see, that's why I work in the record store. You see, every day I don't exercise my potential is another day I'm cheating destiny. <laughs> so what is it that you do again? I'm an occupational therapist at St. Matthew's Hospital. Oh. Working with, you know, the sick, the maimed, the dying, cancer, whatnot, loss of limb, burn victims. Oh my god. Doesn't that get to you? Oh, yeah. My boss is totally on my ass. <laughs> uh, I'll take a dark beer. Oh, just sparkling water for me. Wait! I keep forgetting I'm off the medication now. <laughs> I'll have a Merlot. <laughs> what are you looking at? Uh, guy waiting for the bathroom. He's blocking the emergency exit. <laughs> Can't do that. <laughs> I'm sure he'll move. No, I'm sure he will. I'm sure he'll be the first one on it here while the rest of us are stumbling around gasping for air in the smoke-filled darkness. My online therapist says you can't live your life in fear. Your therapist is online? Buddha 88. He also sells shampoo. You can get everything online. I read about this cannibal who advertised on the internet. And for someone who wanted to be eaten. Yeah, and he actually found a guy who wanted to be cooked and eaten. <sighs> You're gonna think this is sick, but... I actually found that story sort of hopeful. 
No. I completely get that. You do? Yeah. Yeah, it's like, if that guy who's that messed up can find the person he's looking for, then there truly is a lid for every pot. In their case, a really big pot. <laughs> Boy, that guy has really parked himself in front of that exit. <laughs> it's like he's obsessed with it. devious and charming person. Thank you. I'm not sure I don't get this thing with me and guys. I mean, I think I'm interesting. And I'm a very creative lover. <laughs> but they just don't, you know, call. <laughs> Ooh, grilled salmon. I find that very hard to believe. No, really, they have it, and they grill it with lemon or teriyaki sauce. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. Well. Um, uh, Susan, I usually hate blind dates, but... Um, I know I probably should have said something earlier, but... You keep calling me Susan. But Phil said your name was Susan. Who's Phil? Phil! Phil, the bass player. Bowie's friend. Phil, who set us up? I don't know any Phils. You don't? No. Well, if you're not Susan, who are you then? Marty. Marty? Marty. I'm Nate, and I don't think I'm your date. 